All right, in order to solve this one, we're going to set up a proportion, since it's a direct variation anyways, which also is a proportion. And these fractions usually will place the y value over the x, kind of to resemble the slope, though slope is really the change in y divided by the change in x. So to set up this first fraction, uh, the y value is negative 4, so that's our numerator, divided by the x value, which is 2, our denominator. And then we have the second set. We don't know what the y value is, but x is negative 6 right there. We can get rid of that so we can see that 6. Uh, from here, you can cross multiply. So that would be negative 4 times the negative 6. That should equal 2 times y, the other cross. So negative 4 times negative 6 is 24. This equals 2y. And if we divide both sides by 2, we find that y is 12. So the answer to this one is y is 12. <clears throat> and we can check that as well. If we replace y right here with 12, uh, we should get the same thing. And if we check that, uh, 12 divided by negative 6, that's going to equal negative 2. And negative 4 divided by 2 also is negative 2. So... As it turns out, y is actually 12.